Also, I wanted to thank uh, Alexander. Uh, thank you, buddy. Uh, your order uh, that went out today. I uh, hope you enjoy those books. Please let me know as soon as they come in. I've got, I know they got tracking. You should get them between six and ten days. But I uh, really appreciate the order and uh, your support, Alex. Thank you very much. Uh, Larry Brammel. Hey, buddy. Uh, I did move the comic books closer. So now you have a singular view up close of those items. And then also the walls closer. So thank you for that suggestion. And then also, uh, Larry, yes, that Batman number one is still available. If you want to contact me uh, and we'll get together for pricing and shipping. Thanks, buddy. Um... All right, number 10 of this week's top 10 hot comic books is, look at this, this is Thor number 20. This is the first uh, appearance of the Tempest Storm. The, the She was trapped inside Mjolnir. Mjolnir. I was going to say Mjolnir. Mjolnir. I got to just say Mjolnir. I like saying Mjolnir. But she actually comes out of the hammer and she kicks Thor's butt. This is a, a, her first full appearance. And then this book right here goes between $20 and $30. That is a great book at... Oh, hey, I forgot what I was doing. We're going to do it in sections so you can see these. i got to get used to it anyways. My goodness. There we go. That is a beautiful book. All right. So number nine. Number nine. is store number 25. This is uh, Legacy number 751. It's part two of... Got a Hammers, and it is a beautiful looking book. This is the 1 in 25 variant. Man, that is some shiny Mylar. This is uh, worth between 25 and 35 right now, and you can get it for $30. So, I don't know. I don't know why I'm going to present it twice. I got to present it twice. That way you can look at it. And as I'm presenting it, I'll get the next book ready to go. Take a look at that. That's beautiful. Head back to here. That's number nine. And then let me see. And look at that. My text box is not activated or connected. All right, I'll work that out for the next time. I can read you on the side. Um, let's see. Matthew, aloha from Hawaii. Hey, hello, Matthew. Hope you're doing well. Woke up early just to work to catch you. Appreciate it. There's a shout out for you. Number eight of this week's top 10 hot comic books is this is Thor. This is issue number 25, legacy number seven. What did I say? 751. This is the one in 100 variant. This is a virgin variant by uh, Scott Campbell. This is gorgeous. It goes between 80 and 100 dollars, and it's a great book at 90 bucks. Marion shouted out, thanks, happy anniversary. <laughs> Our anniversary is on New Year's Eve, but I'm assuming you're, you're referring to uh, my YouTube channel. Look at that. That is a beautiful Scott Campbell book. Yeah, I didn't even think about the Mylar and the Shadows. I'll work that out for the next time. But that is a beautiful book, and that is number eight. I was a, that was a hard one to get. That was that was a beautiful book. Number seven of this week's top ten. Hey, look at this. This is uh, uh, totally. How am I going to do this? I, I just got to do it. Uh, totally awesome Hulk. This is issue number twenty-two. And if you're not familiar with this, this is the first appearance of Hulk Verine, and it's a hybrid between the Hulk and Wolverine. Uh, they just keep. Uh, what is it? Weapon H, uh, project. They're just crazy. <laughs> it's a beautiful book. And at $100, that is worth $75 to $125. That's a great find. That's a great find at $100. All right, cool. It's, it's weird. Mentally juggling. Look at this. Number seven. Number six of this week's top ten hot comic books is... Go back opening uh, I'll get to where I'm just clicking not paying attention this is spider-man issue number 298 this is Todd McFarlane's first artwork for Marvel uh, it's a also you get a cameo appearance of um, venom this book right here goes between uh, 80 and 140 dollars that is a beautiful book 
Let me get in there and give you a nice close up. I like that book. No Dead Space. I love that artwork. Let me put that up here. That is number six. And as you can tell, we're getting at that halfway point for Tony's target. And Tony's target of this week is, look at this. This is Avengers Forever. This is the first issue. Uh, it has the first cover appearance of Captain Carter. Uh, Peggy Carter appeared in Exiles 3. And that, that book is hot right now. I've showed that to you in a previous video. Both slabbed and loose. But this technically is her uh, first appearance as Captain Carter in the Marvel Universe. This is a beautiful book and it goes between $10 and $20. It's a great find for $15. Not bad. And if you didn't know, Tony's Target, that's where I bring to your attention something that I think that's valuable or something cool or something you might not have known about and I want to share that with you. I set my sights on it. I go get it. I go get it. Hey guys, I want to say thank you for watching me here on YouTube. Please check me out on Instagram where each week, uh, one week delay after my YouTube appearance, I will post these videos and these items on Instagram for, for their availability. Um, just so you know, YouTube, my channel subscribers and viewers have first crack at them. If you see something on the board that you like, type clean down in the chat box and then I will get it to you as soon as possible. This will be interesting doing it live. If it happens, I don't have it on screen so I won't be able to save it. These will be in my live box. I will send a copy to my video box and if you couldn't get through to me on the live chat or in the replay, you definitely have to go through the video part <laughs> and leave a comment if there's a book that you guys want. Uh, you can email me at toyhuntertony.com, uh, Yahoo, sorry, at Yahoo. And then you can find me at www.toyhuntertony.com. Look at that. It's on the shirt. It's on the screen. That's beautiful. Let's get over the commercials. Number five of this week's comic books are, hot comic books are. This is Amazing Spider-Man. This is 301. This is another beautiful cover by Todd McFarlane. And that goes between $100 and $50. And that is a great fine for about $125. That is a nice looking book. Make sure everything looks good. That still looks good. That's awesome. All right. We have got, we've got, look at this. This is Amazing Spider-Man 299. Technically, this is the first full appearance of Venom. He appears in here multiple panels. It is that same conversation. Where does Wolverine appear? 180, 181, and what do you call 182? If he one panel appeared in 298, and he appears in this book for multiple panels, this is his first appearance. This is also by Todd McFarlane. It goes between 140 and 180 dollars. That is a beautiful book for 160. I like that. That is a nice, nice book. I don't want to say anything, but these guys have been in my personal collection for a long time. I've had them and taken care of them a really long time. Oop, wrong mouse. Got two computers running. Number three of this week's top ten hot comic books is... Look at that. This is New Mutants number 175. This is the first appearance of Cable. Uh, that is valued at 150 to 200, and that is a great. Oh, where are we at? That is a great book at 175. I just gotta get my brain around it. Uh, I do know that uh, one of our local comic shops, Acme, uh, Rob Leefield, the artist here shown on this book, will will be appearing in Greensboro on June 11th. Uh, for most of the day, uh, open they open up I think at 10 o'clock, and they will be available with all kinds of cool um, Rob Leefield stuff. If you know him, he's one of the founding fathers of Image Comics back in the day, and he's he's doing a lot of variant covers and a lot of work for Marvel right now. It's it's 
some some people love them some people don't care for them but i i happen to love cable and deadpool and he will always be known as the godfather of sarcasm <laughs> let's move that up that was number three and i know that he will offer if you go to his website at uh rob leefield's uh creations that he will he's got various packs of books that he's going to sign and i i thought he was going to bring them with him to the show at the store but from what i understand they are going to ship that to you personally and then you can meet him with a vip package uh, front in line and he will be doing signatures on site and that is at acme comics um and it's in greensboro north carolina and he will be there june 11th uh, I don't want to say anything, but if that first appearance of Cable uh, does not sell, it's going with me to <laughs> get signed. All right, here we go. Number two this week's top ten hot comic books is, this is Sandman. This is uh, a beautiful book. Uh, it, I think it's in Netflix right now. It's coming out. Uh, I, I don't have a lot of background information other than it is hot and it is difficult to not have it shiny. Uh, this book right here is worth 175 to 250 in its condition. It's got off-white pages, and that is still a good find currently at $200. And then let me check some here. Sheev, you're doing good. That is a good series. King, nice, thank you. And then N.D. Ortiz, happy anniversary. Thank you very much, and I really appreciate the shout-out, guys. And we're getting down to it. Oh, let me get that off there to the wall. That is great, number two. And let's see, what am I at? Number one of this week's top ten hot comic books is, look at this. This is, I'm showing it to you. I'm not even in the opening sequence. This is New Mutants. This is issue number 98. This is the first appearance of Deadpool. This is a really clean copy, and this is uh, direct edition, and it goes between four hundred and six hundred dollars, and that is a really good get at that five hundred dollar price point. And like I said, if these do not sell, then come June eleventh, I'm going to have them uh, get signed by Rob Leefield. <laughs> Let's see. Cool. All right. We're almost at the end of the episode, guys. I really appreciate you being here. Everyone knows that I do a bonus book. And this week's bonus book, that's going to be pretty interesting. This week's bonus book is, let's get on to the so opening sequence. Opening sequence, look at that. It is another copy of New Mutants number 98. This is, oh, i got to show this hand. This is a... A newsstand variation. And the newsstand variation goes between $400 and $600. Now, I have a, a slabbed version of this that was newsstand, and I thought it was going to be a 9.8, possibly a 9.6, and it came back at a 9.4. That one is similar condition to this. So that could be a 9.4 or a 9.6. It's got one tick here, but overall it's pretty clean. And that is a beautiful book between $400 and $600. And that is a great find for 500 bucks. Not only do you have newsstand, I also have the direct copy. That's beautiful. And that, my friends, is... I'm going to just leave it sit there. That is the end of my episode. Now, what I'm going to do is I am going to uh, stop recording and then continue recording through the live feed. And then I will do my, hey, Pooch Man, appreciate it. I will continue the live feed, but I'm going to end uh, episode 116. Guys, my next episode uh, that I'll be doing this weekend, I know it's a, a, a three-day weekend, but my next video, I will have some George Perez uh, key Teen Titan books. And then a follow-up video. I've got some other really cool. I've got Ed Brubaker, Captain America. I got a collection uh, last weekend. Got some really good books in there. And I want to share with you. 
so guys i want to say thank you and i'll see you on the next hunt